When you want to feel good from your head to your toes, you just might want to start at your toes and indulge those tootsies with a little reflexology. Our poor aching feet, we certainly put them through the paces, literally. One way we can make up for all that is with a good old fashioned foot massage, a remedy that dates back centuries. There's, there's pictures in tombs in Egypt that are 3,000 years before Christ that show people getting their feet massaged. What's the secret? Why does this feel so good? It's all in the technique and one age-old practice called reflexology. We visited the spa at the Four Seasons to investigate. Um, a young lady named Miss Ingham, in about 1930, she worked for a natural doctor. And he realized that the body is made of 10 zones. And the zones run from your head to your feet. So anytime you touch your body anywhere, that entire zone is affected. And she, what she did was that she made a map of the feet because the feet are extremely sensitive. And I know you've seen the pictures of the foot and it says you can touch your heart here and, and you can touch your brain here. And since the feet are so sensitive, you can actually affect the organ in that body just by applying pressure to the feet. So when you're applying pressure, you have to apply it very firm because you seem really strong and it seems like it's, <laughs> I can really feel this, it feels good. That's it, you're applying pressure, just like acupuncture. Okay. You're, you are distressing the area and so it makes it want to heal that area. Ah. And that's what you're doing with the pressure. The reflexology is done with um, finger walking, which would mean that I would apply pressure with my thumb and I would balance or apply lighter pressure with the other fingers on the top side of the foot. And I would walk the foot up, I would walk up the foot like this and apply pressure to those areas. And then you can come up the entire zone. And at this luxurious spa, you can get your reflexology with a little side of aromatherapy and massage. So with reflexology, we will combine um, typical massage techniques like joint movement, which is something like this, as well as effleurage movements that we use in massage or might do kneading. It's always nice to get a foot massage anyway. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you teach my husband how to <laughs> While reflexology is still unproven medically, there's no argument that it is very relaxing. It's, it's amazing. It's, it's century, like I said, it's centuries old, and a lot of modern medicine is combining ancient wisdom like this, mm -hmm. and that's where we really receive the benefits. Amazing indeed. As we walk, we're actually stimulating the pressure points in our feet and getting some of the benefits of reflexology. But of course, there's nothing like putting your feet up and really relaxing into the whole reflexology experience.